as I dropped down onto Ribbon Reef this morning, um, I could see straight away that it was going to be a really nice dive. It was great to be back in this crystal clean water, nice warm water. The reefs are carpeted in these blue banded snappers. These are all pedantic fish, um, fish that have created their home on these reefs. They don't move around from reef to reef, they stay on one particular reef. What struck me immediately with these reefs compared to the ones in the Cape is the colourful fish, the colourful corals that you find here, hard and soft corals. Then I've noticed a very interesting little animal skirting along the bottom and as I got a bit closer I saw that it was a, a mantis shrimp, one of the larger shrimps that you find here. And uh, these guys have extremely powerful um, pincers which they actually use for breaking open mollusks like mussels, um, oysters and very impressive little eyes. Found a nice big uh, honeycomb moray, nicely tucked away. This guy was obviously feeding in amongst the rocks and the, the nooks and the crannies here. A couple of nice scars on his face, obviously from bashing into the reef, looking for prey, octopus, um, smaller fish, whatever he can find. Here's a nice big ember parrotfish. Found them sort of snapping on the reef, pulling off bits of, of coral and uh, sponge. That's what they feed on, on actual parts of the reef. This is what Northern Natal and Zuland is all about. Nice big hard corals, big plates. A nice big loggerhead turtle swam underneath me and he just sort of ploughed down, uh, not with much finesse at all, and started feeding on the reef. This is a nice uh, anemone that I found. And as you can see how the surge was pushing the little um, tentacles to and from the, on the, the rocky outcrop. It was really good to be back in this nice clean water and uh, hopefully over the next couple of weeks we'll have some really good dives here in Sedona Bay.